graphs for graphic display calculator. 3. Drawing polar and parametric graphs. Hi everyone! In this video, we are going to show how to draw polar and parametric graph using Casio FXCZ50. Switch on your calculator pressing AC button. Press the menu button to open the main menu. Then move the cursor or press 5 to select the graph menu. After making sure the graph function shows y equals, press F3 to select type command. First, we're going to look at polar graphs. Press F2 to select the calculator to polar mode. Enter 3 in R1 and press F6 to draw the graph. We have drawn a circle with a radius 3. We are trying a new graph next. Go back by pressing exit and enter 4 sine 2 theta in R2. Press F6 to draw. We have drawn two polar graphs on the same axis. You can also change the maximum and minimum values of T theta. For this, press Shift F3 to select View Window. The current setting for T theta is 0 for minimum and 2 pi for maximum. Press Exit to close View Windows. Press Exit again to go to the Graph Function screen. Next, we are drawing parametric graphs. Enter F3 to start the parameter command. Press F3 again to set the calculator to parametric mode. Insert 2 cos t for xt3 and sine t for yt3. Press F6 to draw the graph. We have drawn an ellipse shown in green. As you can see, you are able to draw different types of graphs on the same screen. In this video, we have shown how to draw polar and parametric graphs. Graphic display calculator, as easy as pie.